This is Chase Bank. They have purple lights inside the buildings. Are purple lights being used to manipulate your brain? There's a new theory that purple lights are being installed in public areas to control your brain using optogenetics. Optogenetics is a technique used in neuroscience research where brain cells are controlled with light. So could this be happening? Well, brain cells are not naturally responsive to light. To make them activate in response to light, you need to inject the cells with a virus that causes them to create a protein called channel rhodopsin. And I know what you're thinking, vaccines. Well, vaccines are not viruses, so it doesn't really make sense, and they'd have to be injected directly into your brain to infect those cells. But let's just pretend that it's possible. Let's pretend that you got injected, and now all of your brain cells are infected with channel rhodopsin. If the right color light were shined on your head, it would activate all of your brain cells at once, and you would probably just have an extreme seizure. Just not good and not how the brain works. In order to change your thoughts or emotions, the virus would have to be in only certain parts of your brain, the parts of your brain that control those thoughts and emotions, which would require the virus to be precisely infused into those brain areas, which could only be done through a brain surgery. But let's just say that's possible. Well, it's very dark in your cranium and light doesn't pass through the skull. So you would either need to remove your entire skull or have the lights implanted inside of your head, in which case these purple lights wouldn't be needed. Oh, and channel rhodopsin is actually most responsive to blue light rather than purple light. So this one is definitely debunked and does not get the science seal of approval. Follow for more neuroscience and myth busting.